In this educational video, we present the technical details of erectovaginal fistula repair with episioproctotomy and sphincterplasty. Erectovaginal fistula developed after a vaginal delivery in a 29-year-old woman. Preoperative workup revealed an anteriorly located external anal sphincter defect. Procedure was performed in modified lithotomy position under general anesthesia. Patient had an exam under anesthesia and had a sitting placement previously. After local marking with epinephrine injection, the sitting was removed. The skin was opened up and the sphincter complex was mobilized on either side and divided across the fistula. The dissection was carried out along the perineal body and the fistula tract along the vagina was excised until a clean and healthy tissue was noted. A layer closure was performed, closing the rectum, then closing the vagina and placing intervening sutures between the levators. The mobilized sphincter was overlapped and sutured using 2O PDA sutures to approximate it. Four sutures were placed in this case. The rectal mucosa and the vaginal mucosa were closed with 2O vitral sutures and a JP drain was left in the center of the wound that was brought out through a small stab incision along the left groin area. The skin was closed along the perineal body using trio polysorb sutures. A vaginal tampon was placed into the vagina and removed at postoperative day one. Postoperative course was uneventful and the patient was discharged on postoperative day three. Functional and quality of life scores were good and there were no urination and defecation complaint at eight week office visit.